The Sistine Chapel ceiling, painted by Michelangelo between 1508 and 1512, is one of the most renowned artworks of the High Renaissance. Central to the ceiling decoration are nine scenes from the Book of Genesis of which the creation of Adam is the best known, the hands of God and Adam being reproduced in countless imitations. The complex design includes several sets of individual figures, both clothed and nude, which allowed Michelangelo to fully demonstrate his skill in creating a huge variety of poses for the human figure, and have provided an enormously influential pattern book of models for other artists ever since. Gallery Biblical narratives along the center of the ceiling are nine scenes depicting the story of creation. The downfall of humanity and the story of Noah is told in the book of Genesis. The first day of creation, God divides light from darkness. This was the final narrative to be painted. Detail of the figure of God, which was painted by Michelangelo in a single day and may represent Michelangelo himself, painting the ceiling. To the left, God creates the earth and, to the right, God creates the sun to light the day and the moon to light the night. God separating the waters from the heavens, separating the waters. The creation of Adam shows God giving life to the first man, while Eve, the first woman, watches from beneath his cloak. Detail of God from the creation of Adam. The creation of Eve is based on a sculpture in Bologna. The downfall of Adam and Eve and their expulsion from the Garden of Eden. Two episodes are combined in a single frame. Noah's Ark floats in the background while people struggle to escape the rising water of the Great Flood. Detail from the scene of the Great Flood, the sacrifice of Noah after the Flood. This picture is thought by some to represent the sacrifices of Cain and Abel, sacrifice of Noah, prophets and sibyls. The prophets of Israel and the sibyls of the pagan world foretold the coming of the Messiah. Both have been included by Michelangelo as a sign that the Messiah was to come not just for the Jews but also for the Gentiles. Daniel, Joel, Zechariah, Jeremiah lamenting the fall of Jerusalem. Ezekiel hears the word of the Lord. The prophet Isaiah, the prophet Jonah, the Chamean Sibyl, the Erythrean Sibyl, the Persian Sibyl, the Delphic Sibyl, the Libyan Sibyl, detail of the Delphic Sibyl, the brazen serpent, Haman's punishment, David and Goliath, Judith and Holofernes, ancestors the ancestors of Jesus are listed in the biblical books of Matthew and Luke. This is the first known large painted series, although they were often shown in stained glass. Seat Tree of Jesse Although each picture has a title, the characters cannot be positively identified. Arkham, Eliad, Aminadab, Asher, Jehoshaphat, Joram, Azor, Sadoch, Eleazar, Mathan, Hezekiah, Manasseh, Aman, Jacob, Joseph, Jesse, David, Solomon. Josiah, Jechoniah, Shetiel, Nathan, Rehoboam, Abia, Salmon, Boaz, Abed, Uziah, Jotham, Ahaz, Zerubbabel, Abiad, Eliakim, Detail of the Arkham Lunet, Detail of the Asher, Jehoshaphat and Joram Lunet, Detail from the Eleazar Lunet, Detail of the Ezekiel Lunet, Detail of the Salmon Lunet, Spandrels above the windows are a series of families with young children. The children may represent particular children who are mentioned in the Bible, such as Isaac and Samuel. The composition of many of the pictures is similar to that found in depictions of the Holy Family resting on the flight into Egypt. In the Salmon Spandriel a woman is making a garment while her child looks on. In the Ozias Spandriel a young child is attempting to breastfeed from his exhausted-looking mother, who clasps a round loaf in her hand. Jesse Spandrel, before restoration. Jesse Spandrel, after restoration. In this Spandrel, a young woman who may represent the Virgin Mary gazes out with a prophetic expression. The details of her eyes were removed in the recent restoration. The Ezekiel Spandrel shows a small child gazing out of the picture. In UD, the in UD which surround the narrative scenes may show the perfection of humanity or may represent angels. They were often imitated by other artists. The Drunkenness of Noah group 
left the sacrifice of Noah group above the Erythrean Sibyl to the right of Isaiah the creation of Eve group above the Cumen Sibyl the separating the waters group the great muscularity of the lower back of this figure suggests that he was a stone mason the first day of creation group above Jeremiah. This figure is one of the most reproduced on the ceiling, above Libyan Sibyl. Shields The shields represent violent episodes in the history of Israel. The death of Uriah. Detail of the idol of Baal.